As part of Project Think's Session 2, Journey in the Rainforest, we'd like to take you to Shi Congo for an interview with Oprah Rintree and actual rainforest inhabitants. Ladies and gentlemen, let me present Oprah Rintree. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> Hi, everyone. Thank you for joining us here for our live simulcast on the forest floor in the lush and lavish Shi Congo. Today, my guests will be sharing their own personal experiences on some of the most pressing ecological issues going on in the rainforest today. First, let me bring out Mr. King Cobra. <laughs> King, welcome and please share with us your ecological insights. Thank you, Ropa. Shi Congo is my home and the changes here are killing me. Let me give you a little history. My family commutes from the forest floor to the understory, to the canopy. Our journey home every day used to be safe. Now the, now the travel conditions after rain are life-threatening. By the time I make it through the green crush of monkeys and vines, I see it's a real jungle out there. I can see that traffic conditions and bark hazards can make your daily commute home tough. Yes. Okay, let's, let me bring out our next two guests who frequent the falls area of the rainforest. Let me introduce the Flatter family! Hi, folks! Hi, Angel. Hello. Nice to meet you. Oprah, let me introduce my family. I am Meta Butterfly, and this is my son, Olio. Oprah, the forest is changing every day. We used to carelessly fly free in the lush green forest. With an invasion of men, cattle, and bulldozers, our path every day is met with detours. Ugh, that's horrible. Yes, it's a jungle out there. Landmarks are disappearing every day. The less trees causes the air temperature to rise and the water to pool. Uh, madam, what is your greatest concern for your children? Oprah, I am so worried. My wings are turning prematurely gray. Olio used to be able to take off for school by himself. Now flights to and from have become a family affair. Some days we can't even catch our breath and are literally gasping for air. Wow, this is getting serious. Okay, let me bring out our two next guests who also frequent the falls area. From the crystal pools beneath the crashing falls, let me introduce our two favorite frogs, Red Eye and Kermy. Patty, I'm so glad to have made it off my favorite floating log and hopping right onto your show. Oprah, it's a jungle out there. Rivers heating up, the forest floors are overcrowded, and the air quality is getting worse. We need help. Red Eye, Kermit, it sounds like things are changing for the worse. How can my audience help? Oprah, everyone can make a difference daily. They can save water in their own homes, educating those around them by talking over the issues can make a big difference. I would like to thank all of my guests today for sharing how urban sprawl has reached its ugly fingers into the rainforest. Common problems these friends face? Traffic, travel conditions, detours, and air quality now have become life-threatening concerns for my friends visiting here today and all the inhabitants of the rainforest. Don't add to their problems. Dare to make a difference!